all welcome to my channel i'm mark this is mark's mods and today guys we are going to be doing our enterprise d build so we are going to do stage 37 of build the enterprise d now not a lot going on today uh we've got another uh saucer panel to do so we've got some more lifeboats and windows um a heck of a lot of windows actually um but then we're just going to be putting that onto the saucer frame and basically testing the lights but that's it there's nothing anything really extra to do in this issue so this one should be a really nice quick one to, uh, for you guys today and i'm really excited because i just i love building this model anyway enough of that let's get on with today's build so with all that said let's get modeling program complete enter when ready Okay, so let's get started. Here we have our deck panel that we're going to be working on. And like every time, we've got some uh, lifeboats to put in and we've got some blacked out windows and some clear windows. So let's get started. Now, I've already obviously put the, uh, the way I do it, which is masking tape on. So it's not as hard to do. Quite a lot going on in this panel, to be honest with you. Uh, with the windows. Okay, so them are on. Okay, so I always do the black ones first. Don't know why, it's what I've done since uh, stage one. So I just match these exactly to the windows in the magazine. Now, hopefully this week, I won't have an electrical problem like I had last week. That last week was my own fault. I should have kept an eye on where the wires were. I let my guard down for one minute. And, yeah, it came back to get me, so... Won't be doing that in the future. So, there's one just there. And bottom row, there's quite a few black out windows. One, two, three, and yeah. Another one. I can see a lot blacked out on the bottom panel. Okay, now for the clear windows. Which is just a case of filling in the gaps. Quite a few spare windows today, I think. So if one doesn't go in and I can't, can't get it off, just um, see if it'll fit anywhere else. Okay. Keep going. Get in there, at least get into one of the spaces. Okay, and the bottom ones. I only need a couple for there. Okay, so that's all them windows in. Next, what we need to do, we're going to bring over our reflective panel. That's just going to sit on here, just like that. We do have an LED to put in, so here is our LED strip. And we want to be putting the red and black wire in just to this section here. 
There we go. Jam out. There we go. And um, we need to secure this down with three B three B B B P screws just going in there. No, I might have my screws out ready, but I've been doing that a lot lately. Um, not having the screws ready. Okay, so three B P. One more in. Hate it when it slips off the head of the screwdriver. Okay, so that's them in place. We need to bring our saucer section over next. So, let me get... Builder's cushion down. And we'll bring this over. Okay. So now this has got this upside down for some reason. We're going to be working on this side um, of the saucer, and this is going to be going in down here. Now it wants us to add a wire from 20c which is a white and yellow which is this one just here i'm actually taped to the source section framework okay and i'm gonna have to move this wire out the way for this so i just unravel the uh tape i'll just tape that to there but now okay so this is going in so this is going to come in underneath here and go into our bit there okay that's gone in pretty easily so I'm impressed with that. Then this wire is just going to be coming up through this framework just here. And then we can move this section in to position. I'm going to have to bend that up a little bit. Okay, I believe that is in position. So I'm going to get a couple of DP screws in there. Now, again, I haven't got these screws lined up ready either, and I don't know why. Okay, so DP. One in. <clears throat> Two in. <clears throat> okay. Now what I'm just going to do. Flip this over. I'm just going to take the tape off that I put on. Because I want to be able to test. The LED strip that we've put in today doesn't seem to want to come. Okay, 
but before I do that I just want to make sure that the BP screws are nice and secured into place So, a bit of tightening on that one. A bit of tightening on that one. A bit of tightening on that one. So, let's make sure that everything's flat. That's flat. And that is also. Okay, we can test the LED that we put in today. So, let's check that now. Okay, so that is working. We've got that one lit up. And if I turn this over, you can just see these windows here lit up with this LED. Now, in order to test the ones on the other side, I would need to connect this battery box up to the main circuit board, which I am going to test, but I'm going to test that off camera, uh, just to make sure that there's no wires pinched on that LED at all. That's going into there. But that is all there is to do in this stage. So that is looking really, really nice. I'm really impressed with that. Um, we are given this piece for our um, battle bridge section. But we're actually not doing anything with it right now. So that just needs to be saved for a, a future issue. So that is stage 37 complete. Well guys, that's it for issue, or sorry, stage 37 of Build the Enterprise D. Um, I did check uh, that LED after uh, I stopped the camera, and everything is working just fine. I have to be careful, because although the GST leads are great, we don't want to break anything on the circuit board, or on the battery box, or anything, because it then means getting a replacement. So, yeah, not always wise to do that, but... Uh, I'm really happy with how things are coming along and it's looking absolutely superb. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, please can give it a massive thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And if you're not a fan of any future videos, but as for always, stay safe and bye for now.